Hey, what's up, everybody? The Crab Gamer here, the most compelling game related YouTuber, and you damn well know it. Also, the king of all gaming related media, and you knew that as well. Back with another video, and we have some breaking news, and that is that Microsoft has bought Havoc uh, from. You know, if you don't know what Havoc is, it's the Havoc engine. They've acquired Havoc, the leading provider of 3D physics from Intel. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and link this from the official Microsoft blog. This is legit. Um, and it goes on to say, as we welcome Havoc to the Microsoft family, we will continue to work with developers to create great gaming experiences and continue to license Havoc development tools to partners. We believe that Havoc is a fantastic addition to Microsoft's existing tools and platforms, components for developers, including DirectX 12, Visual Studios, and Microsoft Azure. Um, it's an amazing technology blah 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 um let's see it's you they partnered with activision ea ubisoft nintendo sony microsoft and many other to create more than 600 games including halo assassin's creed call of duty destiny dark souls and the elder scrolls uh, microsoft's acquisition of havoc continues our tradition of empowering developers by providing them with the tools to unleash their creative creativity to the world and we will continue to innovate for the benefit of development partners part of this innovation will include building of the most complete cloud service which we've just started to show through games like crackdown 3 so basically microsoft is beefing up for the future um the cloud computing that everybody thought was a joke microsoft is gambling big time on this not only that but do you hear that that's the sound of the fat lady singing on the console war and when i say fat lady i don't mean my ex-wife i mean the console wars are so below microsoft microsoft is constantly evolving constantly thinking of the future constantly thinking what they can do uh, in the world of video games and beyond this is them doubling down on gaming i mean think about it havoc engine how many people use that every time you see that logo microsoft is going to get paid microsoft no longer has to pay it out of their own pockets when they develop with this engine so now they're free to do that whenever they want and that's going to be huge if they end up buying amd they're basically cutting the cost of games that they make the development that they make for the consoles the chips and things like that you're talking at a really 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 cost effective move for microsoft and the best part is no matter who wins the quote-unquote console war microsoft wins because microsoft gets paid every time somebody buys a copy of minecraft no matter the platform every time somebody buys a game or uses havoc engine microsoft gets paid every time somebody say they buy uh you know amd Every time someone buys a PS4 or Wii U or whatever the next gen one is, Microsoft gets paid. That's what it's all about. And Microsoft is really doing a great job at securing their financial future. They're the only ones talking about this stuff and making moves. These are really good moves in my opinion. This is huge news. Definitely news of the day. To say that I've seen some salty Sony fans would be an understatement. Um, it shouldn't even really be about that. Microsoft is doing moves to secure the Xbox brand for the future. On a day when Yoshida came out and said there will only be a PS5 if developers want it. Um, you know, Microsoft is basically cementing the fact that they will be in the console wars for the foreseeable future. So you guys can take all that hate and stuff and just, you know, throw it out the window. Because Microsoft is securing their future. If you didn't know, it's cloud computing. They also added uh, GPU boosters to the azure network they have things that sony just doesn't have they will never be able to compete with and now they own the havoc engine next time you start up a game look for that little logo at the beginning and then just think about that in the future even games like horizon zero dawn using the havoc engine folks microsoft wins there is no console war because microsoft isn't competing with sony or the ps4 once you guys understand that hmm, you might think a little bit differently just like i do anyway let me know what you guys think Sound off in the comment section. Rate, comment, subscribe. Rack that shit up, bitches. Crep Gamer, out.